Hello once again. I am making this uh, video up, this video furthering on the uh, past video I made about reaching out to the video game directors, creators, and whatever. Firstly, I want to appeal to Nintendo of America. Don't trust the fake in Seattle. This is the face. This is the face of Born Christopher. Changed the name legally to Christian. Is now going by Christine. Weston Chandler of Rockersville, Virginia. Except no substitutes. Even the ID would be totally different. As I have shown that photograph in the last video. And plus, I don't think anybody else would have all of the original prototypes of each individual figure. As they are, as they have been displayed on the on my quick fill shopping Etsy shop. Oh, what I do with those? Ugh. I swear, if I have time for every time, I went one way or another. Anyway, aside from that, <clears throat> I'm really pissed off at Jeff. I'm going by his male name because he is no. Woman, no female soul whatsoever. Regardless, regardless of the fact of having his balls chopped up. Sounded like a high pitched choir boy now. <clears throat> and even, I don't even, and there's so many more worse things than pretending to be me that. And not only in selling the fake Sancho merchandise over the past number of years, as far as I can tell, anyway, <clears throat> he's messed with many a uh, woman's heart and emotions in Seattle, where he is living now. And he origin and he was born in Pittsburgh. And I want to say once, I want to state this once again. He moved away from Pittsburgh after a couple of black men asked him for directions or information. Scared off. What a... He had no balls to begin with. What a wuss. And not only that, but a panhandler. He's collecting social security in three states. Three states. Totally abusing that. Oh, and I got more worse shit on him. Oh, that's where they went. I was going to point this out earlier, but the three figures I've made of my half-brothers and half-sister, as I have shown in one of my recent videos, that I made it to a couple of jerk cops and a chain cop. That's, that's a whole different ordeal right there. I was trying to reach this printout. Of his latest copycat page on OKCupid. He has more to this page. He's done like three. He must have done like, I'm guessing three. I mean, sure, one for Jeff, one for Francine, and now Christine. He's trying to go under my name. That, that pisses me off. I mean, He's no woman. He insulted me personally and my weight and my skills and artistry. He is no superior. He does not hold the fact that I, I alone, created Sancho and Roshu personally in my mind and then onto paper on March 17, 2000. And I have witnesses at Manchester High School to attest that, including the teacher in my computer graphics class at that time. Anyway, I can't believe this Jeff on the putting this on his okay Cupid profile. I mean, he's like, oh, I don't read books because it's too hard. My favorite movies are My Little Pony and Question Girls and the Peanuts movie. And my little, my favorite shows are My Little Pony and Frasier. Oh, pfft. my favorite. 
music is anything only middle school girls would listen to. I my favorite food is apple slices from McDonald's. I eat there a lot because it's healthy good. Mm. I say. Oh, and get this. This just this throws me off right here. Could never do without my Seattle Lesbian Trans Woman Community Member of the Year Award. <sighs> A homeless person. Homeless. Cons women pretending to be me just so he could spend the night with them. And the sixth round is a bonus. A bonus to him. Getting so much income and 60 grand a year out of the fake Sonic You merchandise. And I have not seen one penny of that whatsoever. But that just, but that's not the tip of the piss me off iceberg. What really pisses me off? Playing with the hearts and minds of women. Ugh. Toying with emotions just. Ugh. That's so stereotypical of any male. Oh, and let me introduce to you a few other interesting details. In an argument with his own biological elderly father about his swapping gender identities and whatnot, he assaulted him, punched him during that argument. He, the father never sued, but that's elder abuse right there. <sighs> I never struck my father. Miss you every day, Mr. C. But regardless, he also got arrested urinating on a children's playground area. Oh, and get this fetish. Lemon juice on his, into his urethra. Pee hole. So weird. Anywho, I'm just oh, between all between all that and much more details I know all about about him. I have my sources, and I'm learning more. Between all that and his insults to me directly in the email. I even offered him an easy way out. A settlement, if you will. And what does he do? Insults me right to my face, spits. May as well spit right in my face. But I implore to my fans as well. Y'all know me. Worldwide. You've seen my face. You've never had to see this guy's face. You never had to see Jeff's face. And you know me. I've proven myself on more than ten occasions. Multiple videos. You know it. I know it. Jeff knows it. And if it wasn't for... Oh yeah, he panhandles also. And that's aside from toying with the women's emotions and the online sales of the fake Sonic Shoe merchandise. And the quote-unquote Adult Chronicles video game? The content of that in the story does me no justice. It's all just a bunch of exaggerations from taking out of the context of everything amongst which that I have said and put into my books and whatnot, it just does me no justice. It's a very inferior quality. And I had no input into that whatsoever. I never, ever authorized that game. 
and there's just so much better and it will be done soon that's why I reached to the video game developers in the last video among which anyway I appeal to my fans definitely because I definitely could not have had all the success I had without all of you thank you and I implore y'all to just I would say essentially let's put Jeff out of business I feel like I want to say that but everybody help me out here stand on my side I would very much appreciate that put him down let me reclaim everything that is rightfully mine Now, I admit, in the past, I might have come off as, I don't know, you want to say pussy or wishy-washy. But that's because I did not know, I did not have so many, so much knowledge back then. But I have so much more knowledge now. And I have people and friends among them. I mean that. But Jeff, no friend. Just another stereotypical male bastard. That's about all I can say right now in, the, in my personal venting. And Nintendo of America, Reggie Phil Imaze, and every other employee over there, if this Jeff comes to you pretending to be me remember this face this is my face personally greater science you and roast you in the city of quickville virginia usa right here not his so boot his sorry ass out the door he don't deserve it he don't deserve better Cheating Social Security, panhandling, emotions, emotions in the women. <sighs> uh, but yeah, very bad man. Very, very bad man. And yes, Seinfeld reference. It's valid. Anyway, yes, this is born Christopher. Changed to Christine. Changed to Christian. Going by Christine now. Female soul. Trapped in this male body. Transitioning very well. That's about all I can that's all I can think of right now. My mind goes blank, it bothers me. That's from stress, possibly the autism. I'm not saying it is, but the mental breakouts really bother me. Makes me lose my train of thought and everything. But still, the emotions are there. And the feeling Thank you all. Have a good day.